The Deputy Chief Minister Meghalaya Princeton Tensong informed that the state cabinet has approved of a proposal from the state's power department for the state government to act as a guarantor to enable the Meghalaya Energy Corporation Limited to avail loan of 170 crore rupees. A cabinet meeting that was held earlier this week, Tensung said the loan will enable Meghalaya Energy Corporation Limited to improve power supply. Earlier last year, the state government has also approved a proposal by agreeing to be the bank guarantor for allowing the Meghalaya Energy Corporation Limited to raise the bond of 800 crore rupees. While admitting to this, Tinsong, however, said the amount could not be utilized by the corporation, due to which the financial institution had declined loans to the corporation. Meanwhile, the cabinet also decided to extend the benefits of 7th Central Pay Commission to the college teachers with effect from January 1, 2016. And there are 112 lecturers in the government colleges and also 605 lecturers in the deficit grant in aid. 605. And the total expenditure which has to be paid is 58 crores 5 lakh 69,948 and the cabinet has approved the proposal. The Meghalaya cabinet approved Meghalaya Telecom Infrastructure Policy 2018 which will be effective from January 15, 2019. According to Tensong, the policy was long overdue as the state government has been facing problems in addressing the problem of poor networking on the part of the telecom service provider. He also said that the state was supposed to get more than 2,000 towers in the near future, which will be erected by BSNL and other private telecom operators. With Prakash, APN Shillong.